and welcome back guys. Uh, today we're going to be talking about the Sinku. The Sinku 99 Watt Hours. Now this is its 18 month review. Uh, so I've had this running, powering stuff uh, like my um, GPS, my TomTom, uh, a light. It's been powering that. It's been powering my little shaver as well. It's a USB shaver. And my phone. Uh, I've been using this for the past 18 months. And it's, uh, yeah, it's pretty good. I mean, even the light still works on it. Like, the light still works on it, so that's pretty cool. And, uh, yeah, it's been running flawlessly. I'll, even even under the light it's it just now, I've got an 80 watt panel powering this thing. That's what this is for. It just goes straight out the window. Uh, 80 watt panels out there. It's been, even, been, even in a day like this, it, like dark days, it's still giving off. Uh, power is still charging, so that's pretty cool. Because it only takes in like 60 watts uh, maximum. It only its maximum will be 60 watts. So even if you put 100 watts in there, it would only take up to 60. So the 80 watts perfect, especially on a, a bad day, you know, like a cloudy day. So this is uh, still working away. I'll show you. This is working as well. It powers that tom tom up. So that's that's pretty cool. That way I've always got power when I go out. Uh, we're going to be taking the e-bikes out more more often than normal. So that's that started up. Anyway, um, like I say, it's my phone, my, all my gadgets, all my USB gadgets. It will work uh, like it will charge while it's uh, connected to the solar, but only for the USBs. The minute you hit AC, uh, it, switches, it take, stops taking in power. So we'll take it over here, I'll show you that everything is actually still working away. Um, I'll unplug this as well. And we'll take this across to the... Oh, it's a bit dark in this corner. Anyway, we're going to put the AC on. I'll show you the AC still working. It's got that. Just wait, wait, you know, push it, you hold on to it. And then it'll, there we go. That's, hear that little buzz? That's all it really does. Uh, when you first start it up. If you put too much power into it, it will start buzzing. But uh, yeah, for this it's fine. So I've just plugged in that little telly right to here. And the wee lights came on, so we'll, we'll start that. Now, I've got this set on a little games console thing. It's just one of them USB things that plugs in the back. Just to show you it, uh, it is actually working and yeah, so even if your power went down, you could still enjoy a little bit of gaming, yeah. <laughs> like I say, it's just one of them little things we bought from Timu, I think it was. Anyway, uh, also, it powers up my little speaker. I've not got the speaker turned on. I don't know about the music that comes off this. It might be copyrighted, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I mean, anyway, so this is the 18-month review. AC is still working, like you said. Like I, like I said. Uh, I'm not sure how long it would run it for, probably a few hours. Um, we could always do a test on that. Because uh, that, that's fully charged. And it's on running this. So we could do a time a time lapse, a time for instance. Uh, or you could let me know at the bottom of the, the screen if you want me to do a time. Like how long will it run this size TV, yeah? Uh, I'll do that if you so-called wish. <laughs> but yeah, it's it's been pretty good. So that's a sync you. It only cost me sixty-five bucks, I think it was sixty-five pounds, which is about what eighty dollars in American money. But anyway, it's been very good. I mean, I can't, I can't falter it. Hundred watts it can take in um, to the AC. But if you're just running a little small television like that, it'll give you hours of fun. You know, I take this everywhere with me when I go out camping and stuff. It's actually recharged my motorcycle as well. I plugged in my uh, charger to that because my battery go flat. And this actually <laughs> charged up my battery, you know, enough to get my bike started, yeah. So that was pretty cool. Yeah, I enjoyed that. But this goes everywhere with me. This little thing's been out camping so many times. Uh, it's really good. I, I really enjoy it. It's even the wee light still working, still functioning after 18 months. Everything is nice and quiet. Listen, it's very quiet. That buzzing you're hearing in the background is actually my PC, but this is not making any noise at all. And it does actually work. This you see, as a 
move it across, you can choose different games. We're not bother playing a game. I just thought I'd show you guys it actually is putting something on the screen. Yeah. It's not just sitting and stand by. <laughs> you know what I mean? So yep. Can't fault it if you ever get a chance to pick one of these up. The SYNQ 99 watt hours doesn't give you loads of power, but it gives you enough if you're out camping. It's small, it's light, you know, it's you're easy to carry that, you know. It's pretty nice, you know. I, I, I really like it. But uh, like I say, it's just a small video just to show you guys. This thing is uh, it's still working away, it's, it's absolutely fine. It's having a bit of trouble with the LED on my screen though, giving a sort of rain effect, but yeah, I think it's just due to the, the camera camera scope if you go too close or whatever yeah but yeah it's uh yeah i've been really been really really liking it i can't believe it 18 months the battery still holds its charge you can still see it's four and uh yeah yes sorry i can't fault it so if this is your first time viewing uh on my on my uh, channel please give me a like at the bottom of the screen because that'll help my channel a lot that's my a little puppy going crazy there. Uh, stop it. <laughs> anyway, give me a like at the bottom of the uh, channel if you're already subscribed. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe to the bottom of the channel so that will allow me to do better things in future. Uh, I'm struggling for content. Once the weather clears up a little bit because it's raining like crazy here, we will be taking the e-bike back out for, for a, a run in the countryside. So you'll see that the e-bike that I built uh, a year and a half ago, still running, still still working fine, and I'll show that off as well. Uh, but I'm hoping to get another e-bike once I can afford it, so me and the wife can take the e-bikes out with a trailer and take a tent and all with us here, and uh, yeah, go for a cruise. So we might be investing in a um, uh, what do you call it? a generator, a petrol generator for charging the bikes, or we'll just take a solar panel with us here, depending on the weather. In the winter, it'll be a generator. <laughs> okay, guys, I'll catch you later, and thanks for watching, and thanks for all your support. All you guys have been brilliant. And, uh, yeah, catch you later.